All right, everyone. So after the great game between Florida State and Georgia Tech, we decided we have to do a second video on this. So the tweet that inspired this video was from Kirk Herbstreit. So he said this, man, tough loss for the Knowles over in Ireland to a good Georgia Tech team. The great news is with the new 2-12 team playoff, there's still plenty of opportunities to climb back into the bracket, regroup, and keep battling. So obviously the responses to this were pretty, you know, they, they were bitch to me because remember last year Kirk was the one who was talking about, you know, Florida State shouldn't have been in when they weren't in. Uh, and Kirk was taking heat for that take. And so basically the, people are viewing this as him trolling a little bit, but he's not trolling. And, and I think when you read that tweet, it's 110% true, right? This is why the expanded the expanded playoff is happening because now you get to watch Florida State and actually, you know, they're not done because they lost to Georgia Tech week one. They can get better. They can keep going. They could find themselves back in the top 10 at the end of the year, and they could have a chance to win the whole thing. I don't think this team is done after this one week, but if this was last year, they basically would have the hope to win out and then get some help elsewhere for them to have a chance. And so I, I really do think that this expanded playoff already is making an impact. It's already seemingly a good idea because we, we're going to get to see this team actually play. You know, imagine if this year they do go undefeated all the way through and look impressive and they got screwed again because they couldn't get in. You know, this Georgia Tech team looks like it's pretty good. You know, a Florida State team losing to Georgia Tech shouldn't mean, oh, they're done, they're out, that's it. Now, certainly they have some ground to make up. If they continue to lose, then they're probably going to be out. But it gives these teams a little bit of a room for error without taking still the, you know, the stakes of the games away. You know, they're still, these games are still high stakes because you can't lose too many of them. You know, they're still high stakes, but it also just leaves room for good teams to get in regardless if they have one week in which they slip up. So I don't know what everybody else thinks about this, but this was our takeaway from the game. Let us know what you think in the comment section below. We'll see you next time.